going to take this flagger right here. We're going to move this flagger, which is going to be Mike. We're going to move you to that intersection right there. You're going to catch this traffic here. Travis is going to be right here flagging. Yep. Okay? Uh, we all have radios. When I come off of uh, Fifth Street, I'm going to radio down, uh, let you know, Mike, to get ready to stop this lane of traffic coming off of Roosevelt towards Cherry. Mm -hmm. Okay? Uh, when we come up, then we'll get Travis to stop his lanes of traffic from turning. Okay. That's so you can swing wide in that intersection. Yes, sir. That's so we can swing wide in that intersection. We're going to come through here. Once we pass Travis, Travis is going to catch the tail end of the traffic here and stop them behind us. Um, um, Dave, you're going to be positioned right here. Okay. We're going to go on this on a green light. We're not, I mean, we're still obeying the green light here. Once this light turns green, we're going to turn left here. You're going to stop this traffic from coming through. Uh, which will allow us to make this turn. Mm -hmm. Scott, you're going to be up here on Lee Street uh, stopping the pedestrian traffic right there along with any traffic uh, uh, going uh, towards Chris Bell off of Lee Street. Right now there is an ambulance in, in, our, in, our, in our location. So um, not that big of a deal. What we're going to do, uh, if I can pull the camera up. Hang on a second before you go there. If you go back to that view, that intersection right there at the bottom of the hill there, um, right, yeah, right there. Mm -hmm. So there's an island right there. Yes. You know, of course, there's double lanes, you know, where you're swinging, and so you're, you're going to be able to swing wide. But we have had several trucks that clip the stop sign that sits in the middle of that island as they go around there. Just be cognizant okay. of that when he's going yep. around. He can I'll, use it, but I'll call him, and I'll let, I'll let the driver know to be aware of that. And it, and it helps to stop that traffic that's coming down Roosevelt Brown so that they can swing up and back into that sure. lane in order to go in there. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Um, so, so we're gonna pull up. We're gonna pull up on Lee Street, and we're gonna back him back into the site this way. When I come up, I, I'll I'll be in front. I'll pull up here, and I'll pull. Would it be fine just pull along the green gate, green fence right there? Yeah. So I'll jump out and I'll signal the driver yeah. back. Because the truck's gonna be in that lane anyway. Correct. Right? Uh, Dewey's going to peel off. I'm going to get him just to go to the safety zone right now. Just uh, have him park right here in the safety zone. Um, then we'll get him back into sight um, once we get this load in. Um, that way he's out, he's out of the way. He'll, he'll be, um, he won't be blocking any traffic at all. Okay, He's going to have the bridging trail set up. Um, once we get those guys back in, before we do any more, um, any touch of any loads or anything, we're going to do an ORM right there. Uh, Dewey has the lift plan. He has a copy of the CWP, which we have a copy of the CWP right here as well. Um, we're going to uh, go over here in a second momentarily. Um, so that's going to be our route in. Anyone have any questions on that? Yeah, at the, at the bottom you said Travis, Mike, and Dave, but then you say you're pulling. No, 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 no. Mike is going to be right here. Travis is going to be right here. Dave is right here. So the vehicles behind the truck are just going to stop. It was a pipe the behind them. That's correct. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yes, sir. All right. You mentioned on that one, he's got to wait for a green light. Do I have to wait for a green light? We're going to be taking a right hand turn right there. I, I won't go through that light until yeah until we go through. But you're going to be stopping that traffic because I don't want traffic getting piled up right no, here. No, he's got to make a wide turn. Yeah. Exactly. Correct. Yeah. Right. So you, when I when on my call, you're going to stop that traffic. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll be down here. I'll stop it from both directions. Yeah. There. He stops it. it from, okay. Yes. That's right. The the most critical part in my mind, and, and uh, that I would have any concern about, is at the point that the truck pulls beyond the gate to, to get lined up to back in. So mm -hmm. he's he's influencing the ambulance entrance locations yep. in some way or another. Um, I've uh, I've talked with uh, Medcom. Medcom has the ability to let me know if there's uh, something coming in hot. Okay. If there's some hot stuff. I'm glad in. you said that. No, and so there. Um, the, basically, so we we talked for a second. You know what you want us to do. And he initially said, well, if, if I contact you and say there's something coming in hot, and you happen to be in that what we'll call sphere of influence area right there, mm -hmm. we may have you just pull straight through. And I said, well, at that point, if we're already there and squared up. If we start moving to pull through, we may It'll still block. end up blocking. So he said, "Yeah, you're right." So it's just a matter of staying down. You know, don't don't move. And then it's going to take like if we get a call that we got one coming in hot, and we'll get the message out really quick. And it's kind of all hands on deck in close proximity. 
to get out there and assure that they direct that ambulance in via whatever entrance it, because there's upper and lower and we're not gonna be blocking them all at the same sure. time, right. but directing him in so that he recognizes the fact that we're standing down, we're here for you, we're getting you in exactly. there. And, yeah. just, and just help them get in there okay. at that point. I, I'm not really, I mean, it, it's just a matter of the truck sitting still. If it's a matter of pulling forward three foot in order to clear the entrance way down by the gate, then sure. we probably want to do yep. that. And Scott will be right there. <coughs> I would assume you're probably going to be yeah. right there. You um, understand what I'm saying. Sure, here. definitely, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, I was I was going to mention the fact <coughs> that if we hear sirens, because I have no way of knowing if the ambulance is coming. They're if going. we hear sirens, let me know while we're at Fist Street. We can always slow ourselves down. Sure. And, and do what we got to do. Obviously, you know, he was really only worried something. about if they had one coming in hot. In other words, sure. you know, it's, it's rare Definitely. that they have one, you know, coming in that way. We got a one percent chance of this happening, right? You know, but we still need to. But be our luck, I mean, it, yeah, it, 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 it's Murphy's Law, right? Yeah. With, with the ambulance that's parked there, do, do we need to post somebody at the exit of the parking garage? Like, are we going to have to angle out back toward the traffic? No, he's not going to go in those lanes. He's going to stay in the oncoming lane of traffic uh, to the north side of the Jersey walls that are uh, running down the... Can you the, pull up the camera? Let's, let's yeah. look at that. Hey, where's 522 at? Um, that's where they're passing right now. 522. Is that... Is, that's not Zion's Crossroad, is it? No. No. 136. No. Oh, no. Route, route 522. I don't know what that is. No, that's one. That's uh, Okay. I just told him to slow down. I told him to slow down anyways, so. Where are the stop signs? Uh, yours is right there by gate six. If you open gate six, there's two signs right there. Do we have the gate on the <coughs> side here? Yeah. Yes. We grab one of those from here, we yeah. can walk up. And then I got two for Which gate? Which gate? Six. Number six is by the Six is unlocked. Yep. You did unlock. Six is unlocked. Okay. I did unlock five. I love Five's where it swings out in traffic. Yeah, we don't need number five yeah. unlocked, anyways. Right? Uh, it didn't take nothing for that thing to take a mirror off a car. Uh, you be a hospital at the top middle, right there, just below you. Can they hear? Click on that above the there. Yeah. Like, I mean, what it normally used to come up with the home screen. Save that link on my home page. <laughs> <laughs> it used to come up right there. I just need to YouTube so I have the line. Yeah, yeah, right, says the ambulance is right there now, right? So we're not going to come up here like originally planned. We're going to pull up right here and back him around. We may have to look at that and move one or two Yodocs to get, yeah. get him right there. Yeah. This is going to be blocked anyways. They're not going to be able to come out this way. Yeah, during, yeah you're right. That's right. What's, so, what's blocking that? Our well, truck. Just for the moment yeah. that we're there back in the man, we're going to have to. I tell you what, let's get another flagger, which yeah. would be either you or Ethan. Let's get a flag there and then and, and stop the traffic right there from coming out of the, coming out of the. Uh, You're talking five minutes tops? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Uh, All right. Hmm. Got on the side, Mike? There's two there. Okay. At gate six. Yeah. Okay. Travis, just uh, real quick, since you just joined us, you're going to be positioned right here. Uh, and when I'm coming down off of Fifth Street, I'm going to radio to you to stop the traffic coming towards Cherry Street. All right. We're right here right now, right? You know where we're at. Okay. Make sure you go far enough up the road. All right, let's. Oh, let's, you, you got to stay at the corner because you got to stop traffic coming out of the corner restaurant. He's just right here. here. Yeah, I'll be. He's just, <coughs> no, you're at the intersection. Yeah. I'm saying the corner restaurant, their exit. You can't go any further back than that because yes, you got to stop them. From that's fine. Out. Yes, we we'll, we'll, we'll got it. Okay. Um, all right. Construction work plan. Are we? Is everyone clear on the truck getting in and out? Yes. I don't want to confuse this too much. So I think it's pretty simple. It's not going to be that hard. Okay. Um, all right. So um, our activities obviously modular electrical and transportation and installation. Our specific hazards and controls are trips and falls. Um, Good housekeeping practices, proper access and egress to the site. Um, we have the proper access and egress to the site. Gates are open now, um, so we, we're good there. Um, traveling public vehicle and walking, train flaggers, signage, MOT. Um, so the uh, vehicle traffic, uh, again, the plan we just went through right here, uh, we got flaggers uh, in place. Uh, the pedestrian traffic, um, Obviously, we will yield the right way to any pedestrian traffic. Uh, Scott, you're going to have to right there, especially at the um, the uh, hospital entrance there. Um, 
let us know just on my radio hey there's someone's getting ready to cross here or whatever and let, let them come by we, we want to make sure that we're not impeding any anybody trying to get in and out of the hospital. um kevin's gonna be there with us to uh, help us with the uh, medcom uh situation so if any ambulances are coming in we're gonna stop make sure that we're um we're not blocking the ambulance entries in or out of the uh of the ambulance. I don't know that I want to be right there. I am going to be within radio. I, I You'll think, be within radio. I think one more person added in the mix of that might actually confuse things. I'll, I'll be off. Okay. I'm not going to be in the middle of all of it. Gotcha. Okay. Um, and then moving equipment, cranes, uh, excavators, trucks, high visible vests, spotters, flaggers, uh, and backup alarms. Um, so our truck doesn't have a backup alarm on it. The truck truck won't, won't have a backup alarm on it, but I'll be there to flag those guys in. Um, of course, we're um, using all of our PPE, um, hard hat, safety vest, steel toe boots, gloves at all times, and, and uh, glasses. All right, um, so the access to the area is going to be, uh, for the truck coming in, is going to be uh, gate number five, or number six, I'm sorry. Um, and that's where we're going to uh, pull the uh, modular uh, rooms into gate number six right there. Uh, Dewey's going to go around and he's going to pull into the uh, safety zone. So we have the uh, safe zone um, opened up. Kevin, we'll pull Dewey right into there, and then we'll work on getting his rigging to where it needs to be from there. Um, I believe you guys had the Buck Boys guy showing up this morning. That's right. Okay. All right. Uh, PPE safety equipment is hard hat, anti safety glasses, safety safety work boots, safety vests, anti cut level two glove or three gloves, uh, safety harnesses, which are on the. Um, on the uh, floor already, uh, already uh, we've inspected those, we've inspected the uh, yo-yos, and we've inspected the beamers. Uh, we have a double retractable lanyard, which are, are, we have to put up in the test of the beam, beamers this morning. Um, for the, uh, we, we have face shield and goggles for when we go to cut the uh, steel for the, uh, to take the barricade down. Um, hair and protection. Um, Earplugs, if, if, if we need to hear earplugs, uh, we will need to get a uh, hot, hot work permit. That's something that uh, we'll grab out of the trailer this morning. So when we go to weld back the, uh, the um, steel back to put the safety barrier back, uh, we'll need a hot work permit on that. And of course we have our, uh, the, our welding helmet on that, our welding gloves and welding sleeves on for that. All right, <coughs> any um, questions on any of that? So after the truck passes Cherry Street, and then again on Roosevelt, I believe is the street, or the, the street that the corner is on. After the, so after the truck passes us, we stop traffic, we rendezvous back up at the, at the site? That's correct, yes. Yep. Mm -hmm. now, that said, we'll be the first one done. Mm -hmm. We'll go up there, what you told me this morning, and then we'll go ahead and start getting yeah. For a normal work day. Exactly. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. So